Welcome everyone to the Community College of Baltimore County, also known as CCBC. With three main campuses and three extension centers, CCBC educates nearly 50,000 students each year who choose from more than 280 programs, including 60 online programs. Located in Baltimore County, this community college is one of the largest providers of workforce training in the Baltimore region. CCBC is proud to offer high quality education that prepares 21st century students for 21st century jobs. Based on their goals, students have plenty of options to transfer to complete a bachelor's degree, learn new career skills, or enter the workforce right away. And CCBC makes education accessible and affordable, offering about 80% of its students financial support. I'm your host, Alex Boylan, and over the next half hour, we'll go on a road trip around beautiful Baltimore County to listen to the amazing and diverse stories of CCBC's students. Welcome to the Community College of Baltimore County. This is the College Tour. Okay, let's head over to CCBC's Essex campus, home of the Knights. Let's meet up with Asia, who's gonna tell us about her aspirations to become a teacher and how a Maryland Community College Promise Scholarship has made an education at CCBC affordable. Asia is always up for an academic challenge, but she still finds time for some fun. Asia, tell us more. Thanks, Alex. Hi, everyone. When I was younger, I always had my head in the book. Today, you can still find me reading at CCBC, where I'm channeling my passions into pursuing my associate's degree in elementary education. My goal is to one day become an English teacher, and CCBC is helping to make those dreams into a reality. There is so much to learn and explore with CCBC's course offerings. And to addition to classes where I'm learning how to be a more effective teacher, I'm also enrolled in computer science, psychology, statistics, performing arts, and athletics classes. Now that might sound rigorous to you, but here at CCBC, we work hard and we play hard. With plenty of activities outside of the classroom, you will never be bored. I joined the Aspiring Educators Club, a national association that promotes leadership and helps educators be more effective in the classroom. The Honors Program also keeps me busy. We have our own gathering hangout and we host free events such as cookouts and free ice cream days here on campus. As you can see, CCPC offers so many ways for students to write their own stories, inside and outside of the classroom. I use the scholarship money I receive to start my story here, and now I can use the money I save to plot my next chapters into the future. Back to you, Alex. Asia, thank you for that inspiring story that is sure to have a happy ending thanks to the educational foundation CCBC is giving you. You are gaining knowledge and leadership skills and also saving money. A big congrats on all your incredible accomplishments and good luck in your future teaching career. Thanks a lot. I can't wait to introduce Francesca, who is studying psychology and wants to give children the same help she received growing up. Francesca will tell us how CCBC's online degree programs opened up a whole new world of possibilities and is making her career dreams accessible and easily within her reach. Okay, Francesca, you have us all intrigued. Take it away. Thanks, Alex. So a bit about me, growing up wasn't easy. I spent most of my teen years in and out of hospitals. For my sweet 16, I wanted a car, but I got a different set of wheels than I expected. I got a hot pink wheelchair. Caring hospital staff helped me through that time in my life, and now I want to give back and help children facing similar challenges. My dream is to work in healthcare as a child life specialist, and online classes at CCBC are making college education accessible and achievable for me. When I open my computer, I'm connected to a world of endless possibilities. CCBC offers so many online classes to choose from. Currently, I'm enrolled in a psychology course, and I love it. The flexibility of online classes allows me to work at my own pace, and the professors are engaging and always helpful, even in the virtual classroom. Virtual tutoring is also available, and it has helped me earn good grades. 
Being the first in my family to navigate college, I had so many questions. For extra support, CCBC connected me with a staff member called a Success Navigator, who has helped me find the extra resources that I need to succeed at CCBC. Thanks to CCBC, college no longer feels scary. I always try to see the good amongst the bad. And while I've had to overcome so many obstacles, CCBC has helped me realize that college education is attainable. And with my degree, I will make a difference. With CCBC, I can make my dreams a reality. Thank you so much for listening. Back to you, Alex. Francesca, your story about overcoming life's challenges while keeping your eye on your goal is truly phenomenal. With support from CCBC, you found a way to push aside the obstacles standing in your way, and now your path is clear. We know you will make a difference helping others someday very soon. Thank you. Let's make our way over to CCBC Dundalk, home of the Lions, to meet Nichelle. Nichelle is loving life as her own boss. She came to CCBC with a business idea that blossomed into much more than she could have ever imagined. Hear how Nichelle made lemonade out of lemons and is squeezing all she can out of her dreams. Thanks, Alex. Hey, everyone. Do you have a business idea and need help making it happen? CCBC turned my dreams into a reality and they can do it for you too. My career path has taken many twists and turns, but CCBC has been with me every step of the way. After I graduated from high school, I enrolled in CCBC, took psychology courses, and earned good grades. But I was anxious to start work and start making money. I had put my studies to the side, worked odd jobs, and then I met my fiance, Todd. Todd and I had a mutual love of healthy living and clean eating. Our friends and family loved our juice recipes, and we realized this love of ours could become a business. As demand for our products grew, we needed more funding and business expertise as first-time entrepreneurs. This is where my path crossed with CCBC again. CCBC provided me direct support to get my business off the ground. Through the Center for Business Innovation, I received mentorship from other business owners and developed a comprehensive business plan for Treehouse Juicery. This business plan actually won seed money from CCBC during an annual pitch competition designed to foster entrepreneurship. The pandemic slowed our progress, but CCBC stepped in again and invited us to an eight-month business accelerator mentorship program. Today, Treehouse Juicery's products are sold in various farmers markets and a storefront is in the works. I am proud to call myself a business owner and to work as my own boss, and I couldn't have done it without CCBC, where I learned that a little innovation and discipline can take you further than you could ever imagine. Back to you, Alex. Nichelle, what a fantastic story about how you boosted your business idea and made it a reality. Making the most of CCBC's amazing resources that are available to entrepreneurs like yourself in the community was a wise move. We are all wishing you the very best. Take care. Now it is time to hear from current CCBC student and future dental hygienist, Philemon. Philemon plans to build on the educational foundation he is getting at CCBC and transfer to dental school. Jobs in the healthcare industry are in high demand, and CCBC is training students like Philemon to fulfill the needs of the local workforce. Philemon, tell us more. Thank you, Alex, and hello, everyone. My story began when I moved to the United States at the age of six. And I can remember my parents trying their best to make sure that there was hot food on the table and to make sure that I had a comfortable childhood. As they worked to establish a life here, my parents showed me that hard work always pays off. Now I'm at the age of 23 and I find myself surrounded by people with the same hardworking spirit, the faculty and students here at CCBC. As a student enrolled in CCBC's dental hygiene program, I am challenged every day to thrive and succeed. Outside the classroom, I love how CCBC is a diverse community, giving the opportunities for students to bond with one another through activities or clubs provided by student engagement. 
The opportunities here are endless to surround yourself with the same like-minded people who are always striving to be their best. Looking to the future, I plan on applying to dental school and continue pursuing my dreams using the foundations that CCBC has given me. If you think about applying to CCBC, I say go for it. There's nothing holding you back. I can't wait to meet you. Alex, take it away. Philemon, you've literally come a long way, my friend, in your educational journey. It's awesome. You found the right environment at CCBC to excel in with the support of your professors, and you are sure to inspire others. Good luck on your journey to dental school. Take care. Okay, let's shift gears and head to CCBC Catonsville, home to the Cardinals. Let's meet Ryan. He was able to expand on his love of working on cars and earn an Associate of Applied Science in Automotive Technology degree at CCBC. He now works full-time in the automotive lab at CCBC, passing his knowledge on to students. Okay, Ryan, you're in the driver's seat. Take it away. Thank you for that intro, Alex. When I graduated my high school's automotive technology program, I didn't see myself as college material. All I cared about was working on cars. Heck, I had been working as an apprentice technician since I was 16 years old. Then I was referred to CCBC and its unique General Motors Automotive Service Educational Program. I decided to give it a try and pursue a career as an automotive technician. I fell in love with the program and found myself in company of other gearheads like myself. In CCBC's automotive program, I alternated between taking hands-on lab coursework for eight weeks, then spending another eight weeks working at a car dealership, applying what I'd learned in the classroom on the job and making money at the same time. I enjoyed it so much, I didn't even feel like I was going to college. At CCBC, tuition is very affordable, and some employers offer tuition reimbursement. I was fortunate enough to receive two General Motors scholarships that left me with a very small tuition. In addition to CCBC's affordability, faculty and staff surround students with resources and support. Their goal is to set students up with careers that will take them places. CCBC's automotive degree programs have nearly 100% job placement rate upon graduation. After graduating, I transferred to a four-year institution in Michigan that accepted all my CCBC credits. I earned a bachelor's degree in automotive engineering technology, and I did an internship with GM doing crash testing. Now I'm back at CCBC, teaching and coordinating the automotive program, with my hands under the hood, passing skills to students as they hop on the road to success. Thank you for the opportunity to tell my story, Alex. Ryan, what a cool story. Your time as a CCBC student sounded amazing. You gained technical skills and hands-on work experience while also earning a degree. And you had fun along the way. Now you're helping steer CCBC students in the right direction. That is awesome. Take care. Okay, let's hear from Ayana, who jumped on a fast track at CCBC, gaining workforce skills that landed her job as a pharmacy technician within a matter of months. Ayana's story doesn't stop there. Now she's working on an associate degree at CCBC as her learning journey continues. Ayana, tell us how you're doing that. Thanks for the intro, Alex. And hey, everyone. When I enrolled in CCBC as a continuing education student, I was looking for a job and a second chance. I had run into hard times when I was in high school, and I wasn't able to get my diploma or a GED. This made finding employment tough. Fortunately, I discovered CCBC's continuing education program was a perfect place for people getting the latest start in life. The college really lives up to the word community in its name. CCBC's online job network program helps prepare students for the workforce and matches them to local employers in the area who have jobs to fill, even helping students set up job interviews. I realized this was the program that I needed to get back on track and fast as a non-credit student. I chose the pharmacy technician training program as my career path, but there was just one obstacle in my way. I needed my GED. CCBC provides direct assistance for students needing their GEDs, including prep classes, but my registration test scores surpassed expectations and I was able to obtain my GED within 24 hours of taking my tests. 
After that, within just six months at training at CCBC, I was able to earn my National Pharmacy Technician Certification. My coursework was all online, and the content was easy to understand. I logged into a virtual meeting every week, and my instructor was always available to assist me. I'm happy to say that I now have that job as a pharmacy technician that I was looking for. Also, I'm taking general study courses at CCBC in hopes of earning my degree in mortuary science. If it weren't for CCBC's continuing education program, I probably wouldn't have become a college student. But here at CCBC, it has let me know that anything is possible. That's my time. Thanks, Alex. Ayana, that's fantastic. You earned your GED. You completed your pharmacy technician training. And now the sky's the limit for what you can do as CCBC continues to provide opportunities for you to advance your career. You didn't give up and we can all learn a lesson from that. Thank you. Now we have the opportunity to meet another CCBC student, Kaya. She's working towards an exciting new career in cybersecurity while immersing herself in CCBC's campus life and making new friends. She can't wait to share her story of what all the CCBC community has to offer, both inside and outside the classroom. Okay, Kaya, please take it away. Alex. Hey everyone! To begin my story, I'll start by sharing a few words people use to describe me. Smart, eccentric, and bubbly. After I graduated high school, I wanted a college that would fit my personality, and CCBC was the perfect match. To channel the smart side of myself, CCBC has been a place where I've been able to grow academically and do it affordably with the scholarships I've received. Initially, I didn't know what career direction to choose, but I was able to explore different pathways, and eventually, my academic advisors and professors steered me towards studying cybersecurity, a program here at CCBC that is accredited by the National Security Agency and the Department of Homeland Security. As for my bubbly and eccentric side, CCBC's amazing student life culture has more than fulfilled my social side. There are so many student activities to immerse yourself in and make friends. The environment is overwhelmingly positive, and the campus setting is beautiful. Currently, I serve as an executive member of the Student Government Association, acting as a liaison between the students and the governing members of CCBC. I also participate in the K-pop dance club and the anime club. Campus employment has been another great outlet for me. I found a job that I love at the CCBC bookstore. I always look forward to going to work, and I make sure to talk to every customer that came in. One of my friends used to joke that I would chase down the customers with my smile. It's not every day that you get to attend classes and hang out with your friends at such a historically charming place. I'm really happy at CCBC, and I bet you will be too. That's everything. Back to you, Alex. Thank you, Kaya. That was fascinating. And I'm sure you've got a bright future ahead of you in cybersecurity. CCBC's community looked like it was the right fit for you and has supported you academically and socially as you continue to grow and find your way. We wish you continued success. Thanks for that. Let's meet up with Bernard, a sophomore who is working on becoming fluent in American Sign Language with the help of CCBC. He'll tell us about some important people in his life who helped inspire and point him in the right direction for a career and who mentored him along the way so that he could gain not only the knowledge, but also the confidence he needed to tackle his dreams. Thanks for the introduction, Alex. What's up, everyone? My name is Bernard, but everyone in school calls me Boozy. I won't lie, I wasn't sure what to major in when I enrolled here at CCBC. What I did know was that I wanted to be an educated black male. And when CCBC came into my life, I considered it a divine intervention. My older brother, Michael, has been deaf since adolescence. And American Sign Language is an important form of communication in my family's life. For this reason, CCBC's American Sign Language and Interpreter program caught my attention. The program is designed to prepare you for fluency in American Sign Language, expose you to deaf culture, and ultimately prepare you to professionally interpret between ASL and English. I was concerned about finding a job with an ASL degree. 
This is where another amazing asset here at CCBC, the Mel Student Success Initiative Program, or MSSI, filled in the answers for me. MSSI is designed to improve graduation rates and ensure career readiness among male students of color. My MSSI advisors assured me there was a demand for American Sign Language interpreters and steered me towards special education. I pursued a summer internship at a grade school and now I have a passion to work with children who face learning challenges. In addition to helping me find a career path, MSSI has helped me in so many other ways, from leadership training to travel opportunities and to forming a brotherhood with other students. I've learned to never be afraid to ask for help, especially with all the resources CCBC has to offer. This includes a community of trustworthy advisors and mentors who want to see students succeed, earn that education they've dreamed of, and know that the sky's the limit. Alex, back to you. Boozy, way to fulfill your dream of earning an education in American Sign Language. You had a hard time seeing yourself on this career path, but the folks at CCBC had your back and gave you the support and sense of community you needed to succeed. Truly inspiring. Thank you for sharing your story. All right, we are now ready to speak to Leah, who is not your typical college student. Leah is taking advantage of an early college access program and is going full throttle towards a creative career in fine arts. She is just 17 years old, but has 40 college credits already under her belt. Leah, share with us how you've done it. Thanks, Alex. Hi, everyone. When I was 15, I decided to get a jump start on my future through the early college access program at CCBC. The dual enrollment program allowed me to continue working on my high school degree while fast-tracking my college education. Along the way, my eyes have opened to all the amazing possibilities the future holds. At CCBC, I chose to study fine arts to expand my creative skills in photography and graphic design, which go hand in hand with my love for fashion design. Now I am 17 and have earned 40 college credits with a 4.0 GPA, all at a low cost. In addition, I am participating in the Goldman Sachs Small Business Fellows Internship Program through CCBC. I love participating in CCBC student life and events where I've made friends and connections and gained mentors. I am currently the president of the Photography Club and I also serve as a brand ambassador for the college to share how I've benefited from enrolling in college early. These extracurricular experiences have nudged me out of my comfort zone and built my confidence. Some may say CCBC is just a community college, but it is so much more. It is a gateway to many amazing opportunities and experiences. It can also save you a lot of money and time, as it did for me through the Early College Access Program. As I continue moving towards my dreams, I plan to transfer to the Savannah College of Art and Design, a four-year design college. But before I do, I want to thank all the instructors and faculty at CCBC for giving me an incredible start to my college journey. I would encourage anyone wanting to start their college education early to start right here at CCBC. That's my story. Back to you, Alex. Wow, congratulations, Leah, on where you are in your college education. You definitely believe the early bird gets the worm and you're working hard for success with the flexibility CCBC has given you to jumpstart your education. We've got no doubt you will reach your goals. Keep it up. Now we have the opportunity to meet Anderson, a CCBC alumnus. Anderson is gonna reflect back on his time at CCBC where he was able to improve academically, explore his interests, and ultimately find his dream career path in the information technology field with the help and support of amazing professors along the way. Anderson, take it away. Thank you for that introduction, Alex. As a proud alumnus of CCBC, my story is a success story from start to finish. When I entered CCBC right out of high school, I didn't know what I wanted to be and I didn't have any plans for my future. I just knew that college was the next step. 
CCBC was an affordable option close to my home where I could sort it all out. And I'll admit, I wasn't a star student in high school, but CCBC gave me the opportunity to catch up through basic courses in subjects like reading, and then gradually moving into more challenging coursework, such as chemistry, biology, and physics. I enrolled in these courses at flexible times that worked for me and at my own pace. The faculty were passionate about teaching and generally cared that I succeeded. I graduated debt-free with an associate's degree in general studies, and now I have a job as an IT field support specialist for a national phone company. The company is paying for me to participate in an information technology apprenticeship program at another college. My goal is to eventually earn a bachelor's degree in computer science or information technology and work as a contractor for the federal government. I have not forgotten about the incredible educational experience CCBC has given me, and I am now happy to give back as a member of CCBC's alumni board. I am committed to ensuring that future students learn about all of the benefits CCBC has to offer for anyone who wants to expand their horizon. As we sit here at CCBC, see what you can be. So what are you waiting for? Throwing it back to you, Alex. Thank you, Anderson. It sounds like you are on your way to an exciting future, and it's awesome that you've had the opportunity to transfer to an apprenticeship program and will continue to build your skills while still staying involved at CCBC. We know you're gonna do great things. Thanks again. How amazing is CCBC? I wanna thank all the students who shared their unique perspective about attending this college the challenges they had to overcome, and the dreams they were making come true. At CCBC, you get a high quality education at an incredible value, and every student benefits from dedicated advisors who will help keep you moving in the right direction. This is truly a special place for anyone who wants to see what they can be. I hope you all take the time to visit one of the three beautiful main campuses or three extension centers in Baltimore County to learn more about why so many choose CCBC. Hope to see you on campus real soon, everyone. Take care.